did work just to have it. Every day I do work, man, I came from the bottom for the Okay, okay, okay. Yo, yo. What up, what up, work fam? Welcome back. First thing I want to say is uh, sorry for being gone for so long. I, uh, I understand it's been a year. It's been a year since I've actually did an actual vlog. Uh, welcome back to the work fam vlog, though. There's a lot going on, you know, um, that I haven't updated uh, YouTube, y'all, about. Uh, we have a different type of uh, work fam community as well, man. So it's like I tell you all the time, man, we don't have just one community. It's one big ass family. That's what the work fam's about, is one big ass family, one big ass community. We got a Facebook community now. We got TikTok community. We got Instagram community. We got, we got all that in one big ass family. You know what I'm saying? And now we're back on the YouTube. Um, I know some of y'all gonna be like, you know, hey, where you been? Like, why haven't you? You know, I've been getting messages. You know, and that's what made me really think is, you know, I've been getting messages about y'all telling me, you know, you know, you just gave up on us on YouTube, this is that. Well, there's a lot of things that's going on with that and uh, I'm gonna explain right here. This is what some of y'all from the Facebook community are coming over here to watch. It's a, it's a lot harder to create content, guys, being in the position that I am. I do have cases on me right now. I mean, I'm not perfect, you know what I'm saying? So for me to make that initiative to do something and make content, uh, it's, it's a little risky on my end. Traveling, going places to where I know something might happen, might not happen. You know, you never know. It's like a roll of the dice with me right now. It, it, it's very hard. Right now, this is why I'm making this video, man. Uh, I'm back in it. I mean, I'm not gonna let nothing stop me. I have let this stop me for so long already. It's already been over a year and a half now because of the fact that I've been going through with this. And I'm not gonna let it stop me no more, man. So, as y'all can tell right now, I'm, I'm, I'm here. I'm here, I'm shooting this video. We're gonna be doing all kinds of vlogs, man. We're going all crazy. Um, I appreciate everybody that has been supporting me, that's still supporting me on the YouTube channel, man. And uh, for the people that did uh, message me and let me know, like, yo, work, like, where have you been? Like, you know what I mean? Uh, I appreciate y'all too, because, I mean, that shows that y'all care. You know what I'm saying? Y'all miss my content. Y'all miss y'all miss what's going on in my life. Uh, I appreciate you. I'm, I'm very humble about that, man. So thank y'all so much, guys. But uh, we do have a different type of community too on Facebook as well, uh, if y'all wanna go over there. And uh, here's another thing about that, man. I don't, I don't want to make this too long of a vlog of uh, just, uh, you know, uh, me coming back. Uh, but I am back. So it's going down, baby. Content's about to get crazy. All right? I got some stuff planned for y'all, man. Uh, so I hope y'all enjoy. But uh, hit that subscribe, man. Join this family if you are new, man. If you're not, and you've been part of this family, man, do, do your thing. Y'all already know what it is. Comment in the, in the comments below. Let me know what y'all want to see on the vlogs. Let me know what y'all want to see in my videos. Everything, man, it's about to go down. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna be hustling this whole next 2020, 2022, 2022. Yeah, 2022. I forgot we're in 2021. Uh, 2022, man, it's gonna be a different year, man. And we're going, we're grinding. I'm grinding, 100% making content. This is what I love to do. I love to put smiles on people's faces, and uh, this is what this is what I'm blessed to do, man. So I appreciate y'all with all the love and support, man. I wouldn't be here today, guys. I took off a year from doing from doing this uh and here's the thing i'm gonna be honest with y'all uh 100 honest with y'all man i don't cap you know what i'm saying youtube wasn't paying me enough to where i can actually provide for myself or my dogs y'all remember serena and pegasus youtube wasn't paying me enough man youtube wasn't taking care of me i was doing content i was doing my best it was a lot of work um just wasn't doing it uh, now the only way I can actually pretty much make it on YouTube is because of y'all man y'all buying my merch Y'all supporting me in what I do and uh, you know keeping me going you know what I'm saying So I appreciate y'all man all of y'all that have bought merch and actually supported your boy, but uh Facebook So uh, just in case if y'all want to go to Facebook man right here I'm gonna put a little you know right there uh, Mr. Work Mr. Work on Facebook. Uh, I do gaming as well guys. This is what's been keeping me going for the past fucking year and a half pretty much facebook content creating gaming creating uh content uh is, is amazing you know i get to i get to vibe with my people i get to create content make them laugh get do scary games funny games all that shit man and all one big content not only that i get to relate to my people on there as well so it's very very awesome man uh, i enjoy every bit of it i love it and not only that this is this is why i've been eating this is how i've been living like they've been taking care of me man that's why i told I, i'm telling myself right now you know what i mean like you know from getting those messages from other work fan members telling me like yo work like where you been on youtube man you just gave up on us and went straight to facebook it's not that i did that man it's just i gotta go where where i can get fed you know what i'm saying where i can eat you know when you look at it too in life man it's not all about it's not all about the money i mean it's not it really ain't trust me it's not 
uh, I'm, I'm more happy on doing what I love to do. And if y'all don't understand that, I mean, guys, I do what I do right now and I'm still just like barely making it, but I'm okay because I'm happy and I love what I do. All right, so I'm taking that initiative, man, to push more into the YouTube channel for y'all. So if y'all can, man, hit that like, hit that share, hit that sub, you know, subscribe to my channel. It's free, man. It's free. You know what I'm saying? All that, that support shit is free. You know what I'm saying? Sorry if I cussed. God damn it, YouTube. I forgot. Y'all can't cuss. Uh, <laughs> yeah, man, we're coming back. And uh, let's go ahead and get uh, rest into the vlog if I got anything else for y'all right now. But I do have some other stuff that I want to post right here. This is going to transition off to a... Uh, some shit I should have posted a long time ago, but I didn't, so I still have content available. Uh, but uh, yeah, other than that, man, welcome back, guys. And um, hope to see some cool comments in here, man. So let's get it, baby. Right now, I'm on my way to go deliver some money that me and my family made on Facebook. So there was a, a friend or a work fan member that is a work affiliated on my Facebook page that supports me on there since I started on Facebook. He lost his, he lost his little brother. Uh, due to a shooting uh, here where I live where I'm, I'm locally at he lost his little brother man And uh, he you know, he hit me up and he was like yo work like man I, Like I don't know how to feel bro. I just wanted to contact you because I feel safe talking to you This is that and um, it, it was amazing man It was amazing how he convinced me and stuff like that and I love that man I have a lot of messages like that, but it's just you know I, I felt a different type of way man hearing it from him and stuff like that personally so, um, you know, I took that um, that other step, man, and I told my family about it on Facebook, and my community got to the point in less than six, no, five hours, in less than five hours, we raised uh, 250 bucks, and that's on top of the 50 that I'm about to give right now, too. So we raised 300 bucks to help to go to the funeral to uh, help bury a uh, little man, man. So uh, definitely, and if he's seeing this right now, man, you know, all, I mean, all respect, brother, you know, I appreciate you, man, and uh, thank you for supporting me. And um, I'm, I'm glad me and my family got to help you, man. And shout out to everybody that did help. Um, I do want to shout them out too, man. Uh, like I said, I'm going to be shouting out my people. I mean, I know some of y'all going to be like, work. Like, really? No, nah, I don't give a damn. Hey, these people are, are a blessing, man. They're amazing. They help me live. They help, you know, they help out a lot. Yo, shout out to Robert for the $20 donation. Shout out to Castillo, Stephanie, Francis, Marina, Jacob, Abraham, Kayla, Trino, Trino, is it T? I think it's T, yeah, T. But Trino, Des, Desiree, Landon, Oscar, and Abraham again. Um, thank y'all guys, I appreciate y'all, man. I love y'all, man. Uh, y'all are amazing. Y'all the reason why we keep doing what we doing, man, and the content keeps coming. So thank y'all so much, man. I appreciate y'all sexy asses. So we're on the way right now to go deliver this money to him and uh, give him the money, him and his family. Um, and uh, yeah, man. But uh, definitely our condolences, man. And uh, you know we did what we could. And it's like I said, man. I mean we can't we can't come out with crazy and be like, damn, here's here's three thousand dollars. But uh, we got a little impact where we hit it and know that you know the work fam's there. You know what I'm saying? So definitely. So we're on the way there there right now. And uh, yeah, I'll see y'all here in a minute, and then uh, we'll see how it turns out. Let's go. What's up? You smoking puppies or what? My man. Is that him right there? That's my little brother. That's what's up, man. Mommy. Hi, how's it going? Nice to meet you. Um, sorry, sorry about what happened and everything. Uh, my condolences. Um, so I don't know if Lorenzo told you or anything. Get all the way. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, so uh, Lorenzo told me what happened, man, and uh, so I got my family, you know, from my community to actually raise some money for y'all too as well. Yeah. We got the we got the chance to uh, raise 250 bucks for y'all, man. man and then you, I'm, man. I'm throwing in another 50 for that, so 300 total, man. Yeah, so, sure, man. Yeah. That means a lot. To yeah, us. of course, of course, man. We wanna we wanna look out. Lorenzo's really good people, you know what I mean? Yeah. And, uh, he's part of this family, man. So we look at y'all as part of this family too, as well. You know what I mean? And uh, wanna help out as best as we can. Like I said, I'm sorry for what happened, man. And uh, you know, my condolences. I know it's hard to lose someone. Uh, I've lost about quite a few people of myself, so I know how this feels, you know. But um, I mean. Look at it this way, man, he's an angel, you know? Yes, he's over y'all right now, he's over you, he's over Lorenzo, he's over your mom, over the babies, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, he's he's here still, no matter what, you know, so. Appreciate you, man, doing yeah. all this for us. You know, you didn't have to, but you opened up your heart for us, and you made your family our family. Yeah, most definitely, man, most definitely. That's what, that's what it's for, man. Yeah, he was on, on a great path, it's just, you know, you, you get influenced by your. For hanging around the wrong people. Wrong people, your peers, they peer press you, and. I know you were scared the whole time. Most definitely. 
everybody's scared you know what i mean when you're young yeah. you just want to you want to be around the crowd you know and uh yeah. you know the thing is and, and that's 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 the crazy thing that's what i do you know what i mean like i used to be in that life you know i used to be the point i'm pretty sure you have too you know what yeah. i mean we've been in that life but you know now nowadays man we need we need more people that are leading to be yeah. an example, you know what I'm saying, to, to push, you know. That's why I do what I do with YouTube, man. Yeah. I, I influence, I, you know, motivate to, to, to be something different, man, instead of, you know, trying to be around those people that are going to lead you on the right, wrong path and making, making you know, making, a, you know, yeah, something I, happen, you know what I mean? Yeah, me and my family are going to come up with something and it's called AJ's Way. AJ's Way? AJ's Way is where, you know, you're young and you don't get, feel, if you feel peer pressure, you know, you go to your your adult, you know what I'm saying? Like, you don't sit there and just take it. If you feel like you're not doing something right, you go up to your nearest adult and you talk about it. Even if you feel like, oh, I'm too, I'm too uh, big, you know, I'm like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, Come talk to us. Yeah, yeah talk, talk to, to us. us. Yeah. AJ's way is, you Most know, definitely. he was a hard worker. You know what I'm saying? I know he was, uh, he's, he's an angel to our eyes, but you know, to other people, maybe he's... Might look like somebody some, different. Somebody different. Yeah. AJ, man, he worked all summer long, and he saved up for his cars, and so he's on the right path, it was just, he took the, rock, the wrong turn with the wrong people, you know, and yeah. I know he was in there scared. So if you had a message to, uh, to I mean, and it's just to everybody, because, you know, like I said, I'm vlogging, uh, if you had a message to tell the youth, you know what I mean? Someone around his age and of course being a brother of yours and a, a son of yours, man. Um, what would you what would you say to everybody? Like just I mean, if, just keeping the right path, you know, if you feel like you're being peer pressured or you know you have that feeling that you know it's something your family wouldn't want you to do, you know, talk to somebody, but don't be scared about it and Mr. Work? Yeah, that's me, man. That's me. <laughs> nice. You look just like Lorenzo. <laughs> so. <laughs> Andro was a hard worker. Mm -hmm. Hard worker. He was a hard worker. After school, he would just go straight to work. On the weekends, that's all he'd do is work. And things just didn't go with what I know that he thought he was going to go do. Yeah. I'm not saying that he's God himself and he was perfect. That's not what I'm saying. All I'm saying is that I know Alejandro went out there thinking that he was going to go out and be with, with some friends, you know, yeah. probably smoke as us teenagers have done. Yeah, was he, he's he was the, the only one was, that there was four people in that car and he's the only one that got hit out of 15 bullets. Only one hit him. That don't make sense to me. Hmm. He had just met them. He called my mom telling her, hey, I just met some new friends. They're so he right. recently just met he these guys. He had just met the guys in the in the front what? seat, in the passenger seat. He had just met them, and and they did that to him. They did that to him because Alejandro was he was a good kid, man. Mm -hmm. He was a kid, and he was a teenager. He was, you know. Of course, we've all been there. We've all, you know, experienced. We've all, yeah. You know, had fun. We were just teenagers. Yeah. And he thought he was gonna make it back home, and it was just gonna be another teenager night. He didn't make it back home, and it just—it makes no sense. He, they tore our family apart. They tore something from our hands that we could never get back. Yeah. We can never get him back. So you don't have to follow nobody. Don't follow these young kids thinking that they have good intentions because they don't. They don't have good intentions. A lot of these kids run around, you know, and I don't know, just be teenagers. Yeah. Whatever the case is. But they you don't, don't know their you. real intentions. From yeah. what you come from, you don't know where other people come from or what their intentions are. I know who my brother was. I know he was pure. I know he was he he was pure. There was there was no doubt about that. I don't doubt that for one bit that he that he went out there, you know to go out and have fun. He didn't go out there for all the mess that the media is saying or that the kids are, you know, he didn't go out there for that mess, man. He had his hardworking money. Yeah. He had, he bought two vehicles this past summer. Yeah, that's what he in just a told summer. Me. In mm -hmm. one summer, he bought a vehicle. So what I'm saying is don't follow these people that you, you want to make friends with or that you just want to try to click in with just to try to click in. Because you know what? At the end of the day, your family pays for it. Your mother pays for that. We pay for that. His family will forever pay for that. For just trying to make friends. Friends that you don't know their real intentions behind their words. You don't know what their real intentions are. 
And in order for them to just have somebody to do their dirty work or even just do their, you know, just to get somebody that's pure, that's willing to go and hang out with them, they're, they don't care. They don't care. They don't care. They're, they're just, there's no words that I can say that, that will ever bring my little brother back. Nothing. I raised him like he, I raised him with her. I raised him with my mom. She brought him home from the hospital and straight with me, straight with me. We raised like my my son yeah and for them to do that to him that's inhumane of what they did to him and just left him there just left him there by himself it's inhumane what's up baby how you doing my bro <laughs> what's up brother how you doing he's coming to talk to the family yo i brought you that uh, loaded potato and uh some hey, heck yeah, man. Appreciate you. Thank you. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Um, so, you yeah, no doubt, man. Uh, so, it's like I told him, guys, um, we didn't get to raise as much, but we raised about 250 bucks, bro, in that four hours that we streamed. That, yeah, no doubt, man. No doubt. Like I said, um, anything, anything, anything helps. I mean, even if it's a dollar, <laughs> yeah. anything and everything helps. For now, sure. I also have uh, about a good, I got 250 from that, and I want to go ahead and do my part two as well. So I'm gonna do, um, I'll do 60, and that's going towards that too, so. Thank you, man. Yeah, no doubt. Like I said, I mean, I appreciate everybody, especially from the gaming, you know. Yeah, the gaming community. The whole yeah. Yeah. Say, Mr. Yeah. Mr. Worth, Mr. Worth, we're like, shut up, Lorenzo. <laughs> Every, everybody in yeah, the, we, we, you know, the whole family, yeah. and I appreciate every single one for, for helping out, even if it's $5, a dollar. Like I said, anything helps. Um, I just wish that we weren't going to it right now. Yeah. You know I mean? No, I feel it, man. I really do appreciate you coming by. Yeah, no doubt, that. man. No doubt. That, that came out of nowhere, too. So I was like, damn, all right, you know, the whole stream, okay. Yeah. So I, I really do appreciate it from bottom yeah. of my heart, man. You Most know? definitely, man. And it helps out. It's like I said, man, we, you know, you're part of this family, bro, so. I mean, we're he's gonna help out as best as who he is. Yeah, he's yeah. A brother. He was a oh, really? Guy. Yeah, he really was too. He, he wanted it. He wanted. I know he wanted to play Cold War too, but he never really got his activation up or nothing like that. So yeah. But he he always played Fortnite, um, GTA. GTA um, yeah, he was always on the game. Basketball, man. Yeah. He always played basketball. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, man. I, I appreciate it for sure. Like, there ain't nothing below. Just the donation itself, it helps tremendous. Like, it helps out a lot. Like, it shows, you know, the love and the loyalty for sure. So, yeah, most definitely. Well, even just showing up. Yeah. yeah. Even, not even the donation. She's, you showing up and trying to make something out of it. And I had already told them, even if it's to teach other kids something. Exactly. That's all that matters. Hey, that's geez, all that matters. Yeah. She, and she does that. I like that. All she wants is justice for her son, and yeah. all she wants is other kids to learn. Hey, you don't have to sit there and follow other kids. Yeah. You don't have to be a lead by example instead yeah, of being lead, a follower. Lead by, yeah. And he wasn't so much of a follower. He was just more of a he wanted to be around yeah, people. You know, you know? That, that's cool. You know, they want to be friends. I'll go be friends with them. You know, whatever. But never like with friends. He fixed up this car that's right out here. That's by what. That's himself, what he, yeah, that's what he just told me. By himself fixing up on he his other truck. He was waiting on a mechanic. He was waiting on a mechanic one day all day long. The mechanic never showed up. He went to AutoZone by himself. Got the alternator. Looked it up on YouTube, and by the time we knew it, that car started up by himself. Yeah, see, my sister good. said she showed up, and he was all up on the in the hood, the same way. Look at that. Was doing. <laughs> so, yeah, he did it on yeah. his own, man. You know, you know what you I'm don't saying? Know what people's intentions are, especially nowadays. You know, you just don't know. No. You don't know what what backgrounds they come from. You know, who, you know your family is, but. When it goes into other backgrounds and then other people's intentions, you just don't know. Yeah. And, you know, I'm sorry to say, but I've always been taught friends usually don't last forever because not all friends are real. Some of them Facts. come with very ill intentions and you won't find that out until... Until it happens. Until it happens yeah. and until you're hurt, you know, you're hurt emotionally, you're hurt Physically. this way yeah. or you're hurt any other way. You know, there can be different ways of you being hurt just by, I'm sorry, but trying to make friends. Yeah. 
<laughs> and it's like exactly like you said. That was a nice saying, by the way. Um, I have the same one, and he might know what it's called, but it's called "Bosses All in My Circle." Mm -hmm. So it's pretty much you know getting people that you, your circle might not be that big, yep. but it, it might be as, as small as this. Mm -hmm. But it's to the point where you know you that know. those people are there for you, exactly. and that's it. And it doesn't matter if it's just one, two, three. Yeah, and that's but, and that's usually what he's stuck to. That's usually what he's stuck to. He usually just stuck to us because that's how we. That's how we are. We don't. I don't like a lot of outer people, you know, it's yeah. just not us, but that's how he was. But when he went to a high school, it's different. It was like he wanted to at least make friends. It was a new school. All his friends went to Monterey. They didn't want to accept him at Monterey because we didn't have that address, well. you know. So when I put him there at Coronado, like I said, that's why I promised him, hey, I'm going to I'm going to move you. Yeah. I'm going to move you so that you could be with some friends. When he met friends at Coronado, he she just, he beach. thought it was just friends. He thought it was like kids, you know, just wanting to go out and have fun. Not all this gun stuff and yeah. all this violence. Violence just, it's not the way that it was. You don't just throw it down and, you know, hey, good fight, you know. Yeah. It's not like how it was back then, right? Nah, that yeah, was a no, good fight. Sure. Let's keep it going. That's for sure. It was, it's nothing like that. Now it it's, back then. yeah, at they pull at out all. guns and they want to act like they're just, they're invincible, you know? Yeah. And, I know my brother, he wouldn't hurt nobody like that, man. He would have never hurt nobody like that. I know my brother would never hurt anybody like that. And for them to do that to him, it's just not right. All right, guys. Welcome back, familia. Welcome back. Uh, so, I literally spent all day uh, with that family, man. And as y'all can tell, uh, there was a lot of messages, a lot of emotions rolling around there. So uh, I literally stood pretty much the whole day with that family, man. Uh, they're amazing, awesome vibe people, uh, very beautiful people, man. Every one of them. They got a huge family and uh, it's amazing, man. But I hope a lot of y'all understand that message that uh, all of them were pretty much relating, man. You know what I'm saying? There's a lead by example and then there's a follower. Um, you can follow, and that's the thing, I'm not saying anything about following, man. There's a lot of people that actually follow people because of how success they are, and they want to get to that route, and that's cool. Follow somebody that you know that's doing right, that you know that you can learn off of, or actually get some successful stuff out of that, you know what I mean, as in a goals or something like that. And, you know, when you know you're following the wrong people, guys, man, surround yourself around the people that you know that'll lead you in the right direction, okay? But I don't wanna to take too long, man. It's been a long vlog already. Uh, I do have some more videos and stuff like that that I wanna show y'all, so uh, I hope y'all enjoy. Also, what I'm doing for the holidays right now of uh, Halloween, uh, I didn't wanna cut a pumpkin. Uh, I'm probably still gonna end up cutting a fucking pumpkin, uh, but uh, I decided to cut little things out. See, as you can see. So it's pretty cool, man. So that's what I'm doing. It's, uh, it's actually one, 42 in the morning right now because uh, I've been over there. We created a fire. It was a nice vibe, man uh, I should have vlogged that too, but I was just so in the moment I didn't want to pull out the vlog camera right in front of everybody But uh, and they didn't care about the vlog camera man But they, it was just you know, it was my preference of uh, just keeping it as you know, like a vibe You know what I'm saying? I was enjoying myself. So if y'all want to see these man come to uh, Mr. Work on Facebook uh, They will be in my gaming page I'm cutting these for my gaming page man, and they're gonna be right behind me So hopefully these turn out good. I was gonna put an LED underneath it and let it shine out I don't know how it's gonna look, but uh, I decided to do this instead. This is how I usually look though They came with the like the blacked out, you know mouth and everything blacked out eyes and like that, you know But um, I cut them out so the light can show through but uh, yeah, it's easy. It's a simple you know, and less messy, <laughs> but definitely, man. Uh, thank y'all so much, guys, and uh, I appreciate y'all. Much love, and we'll see y'all on the next vlog. Peace, peace, peace. Work, work. <laughs>